Hello friends, this is part 3 of solved question paper statistical mechanics C14 of 6th semester 2023 Dibrugar University. So before we start, please do subscribe to the channel, hit the thumbs up button, also share with your friends since we me to create new contents for you and help me to grow my channel. And if you want to follow me on Insta, this is my Insta ID O J H A L A K H Y A J I T 123. This is my Insta ID. You can follow me on Insta. So now let's see, start. We have already solved up to question number five. Now today we're gonna start from question number four A. So I have already made videos on these two, four uh, A and four A or. Okay, links are in the description box. I have written uh, question number four A and then uh, link is given and four A or in the description box. It check the description box. You're gonna get there okay then 4b let me give you the answer here is the answer to question number 4b this is the first phase uh, page number one here is the page number two pause the video and take the note or you can um, take the screenshot okay this is the second page here is the third page this is the fourth page okay this is the fifth or uh, last page okay and uh, now let's answer to the question uh, question number 4c there are two questions 4c and 4c or uh, let me show you question number 4c so 4c uh, answer to question number 4c uh, it starts from here this is the first page okay take the skin sort this is the second page this is the third page right and this is the last page okay now 4c or so this is the question 4c or how many photons are present in one centimeter cube of radiation at 227 centigrade what is the average energy of photons present in one centimeter cube of radiation at 227 centigrade and uh, here uh, this result is given this is very important for this problem okay so let me show you how to solve now, number of photons per unit volume having frequencies between nu to nu plus d nu is given by this relation and uh, the total number of photons in a unit volume having all the frequencies so to find the photons having all the frequencies uh, frequencies in unit volume that will be obtained by integrating it from uh, uh, integrating it from zero to infinity okay and uh, now let me go to a new slide so we have to substitute now now let us substitute h nu by kt is equal to x if you define it with respect to uh, nu uh, then you can differentiating differentiating both sides uh, with respect to x we have got this then from here we have got d nu is equal to this kt by h by dx in sorry into dx so we're going to substitute this in the relation that we have got in the previous slide okay so then we're going to get this right now here you see already in the question it is given that uh, the integration from 0 to infinity of x square dx by e to the power x minus 1 this value is given 2.405 this one okay uh, this is already given in the question okay so that's why we have got this now let's put the value of Boltzmann's constant Planck's constant speed of light and putting those values we're gonna get this right now if we calculate this let me go to the uh, go to a new slide okay so what we have got we have got this so i have used calculator here to calculate <coughs> to calculate this and i have got this one this number of photons per meter cube okay so here uh, as i have you put the values in uh, si units so 
result is obtained in photons per meter cube but in the question it was asked in one centimeter cube so let us convert this per centimeter cube so let us divide this by 10 to the power 6 then we're gonna get this answer so this is the number of photon in one centimeter cube right so this is the answer now we need to find the uh, you know uh, average energy per photon we need to find average energy per photon let me show you how to find that so let me go to new slide average energy per photon average energy per photon that will be obtained by es by n let me reduce the thickness okay e by n so here so uh, energy of radiation per unit volume is given by this expression 8 pi 8 pi to the power 5 k to the power 4 by 15 c cube a cube into t to the power 4 right divided by n so here you see we can do one thing instead of putting this the value of n directly we can put uh, this expression then it uh, uh, few terms will be cancelled okay then what we can do here so then what you're gonna get 8 pi to the power 5 k to the power 4 t to the power 4 a cube c to the power 3 divided by 15 c cube a cube k cube t to the power 3 into 8 pi sorry into 8 pi 2.405 that's what we're gonna get so what we have used here we have used this uh, result for n okay so then cancel the terms which terms can be cancelled okay so here h cube h cube gone k to the power 3 cancels k k to the power 4 to give k only then t to the power 3 cancels t to the power 4 to give k sorry t only 8 pi cancels 8 to the power of, uh, 8 pi to the power 5 to give only pi to the power 4 then uh, let's see what are the terms can be cancelled now okay c cube c cube will be gone right so we have got here only pi to the power 4 15 into kt by 2.405 and if we put all the values of pi boltzmann's constant and temperature temperature here uh, the temperature it was given uh, this uh, just to, uh, give me a temperature was 272 so we have converted into kelvin 272 plus 2 sorry 727 plus 273 so it gives 1000 kelvin right so here you see when i have put the uh, temperature here it was in kelvin okay so now if we put those values here then we will get approximately equal to after putting all those values uh, of this constant and temperature uh, you're gonna get approximately equal to 3.79 into 10 to the power minus 20 joule okay if you convert this into electron volt then what uh, you're gonna get you see so what is the result we can uh, so this is the average energy in joule if you want to convert in ev electron volt divided by uh, you know one electron volt is 1.602 into 10 to the power minus 19 joule right so this is ev okay that's what we can do right so then you're gonna get approximately 
2.79 इलेक्ट्रॉन वोल्ट 2.79 इलेक्ट्रॉन वोल्ट लेट मी चेक इट वंस सॉरी इट्स सपोज टू बी जस्ट गिव मी अ सेकंड इट्स सपोज टू बी 0.236 इलेक्ट्रॉन वोल्ट ओके दिस शुड बी द करेक्ट आंसर so hope you have understood this thank you for watching see you in the next video remaining questions will be solved in the next video bye bye